I was contacted by Virginia Rudder, who was the uh, state of Minnesota Solar United Neighbors coordinator or director. And she reached out to see if um, anybody in Bemidji might be interested in uh, joining together to learn more about solar and potentially forming a bulk buy group so as to get better prices on their solar installs, which is the Solar United Neighbors model. It made more sense to me to just buy a system and have that on my land. We need to reduce our carbon footprints. We're putting too much carbon dioxide into the atmosphere, so we need to reduce that. We had reserved Beltram Electric Co-op's conference room, and it was standing room only, over 90 people in attendance, by far the largest info session in the state at that time, beating out Minneapolis and Rochester, and we felt pretty proud about that. Um, as well as Minneapolis was creating a solar co-op during the same time frame as Bemidji, and we ended up having more members in our co-op than the Minneapolis group at the time. So again, it, there was just this outpouring of interest in a very small area, um, which I think speaks pretty loudly to the amount of uh, not only interest, but action like oriented folks in our community. I really see the big benefit in like coming together as a community to learn more about the technology and learn more about the opportunities and barriers and have sort of that broader discussion. So I'm generating about as much electricity now as I'm consuming. That's about half of what I was paying before I had solar. interested in clean energy, I highly recommend looking at usage first. I think that a lot of times people jump into the renewable side because it's maybe more exciting than the efficiency side, but um, across the board it's just way more affordable and way more uh, mindful to go about it in the, in the way of conservation and efficiency first.